Let's hope you all are doing so well. So today, our topic is when you get what you want in another body. Yes, when you get what you want in another body. I wrote them down. I don't want to forget anything because this topic is a great one. Because it's a great topic, <laughs> I don't want to forget anything, okay? Sometimes our aim might be to get, uh, you know, you hear some ladies say, I want a tall, dark, handsome looking guy that is caring that is god fearing that is this but he must be tall or he must be handsome see eh let me tell you sometimes what you are looking for might be in another body what if you find those things that you're looking for caring rich has everything in a man that is not tall that is not dark that is not handsome does it mean that you will not stick to him does it mean that you say because he's not tall, dark, handsome, or fair, whatever color, complexion you want, that you're not going to um, go to stick to him? What if those things you're looking for, you're looking for a man that is caring, understanding, um, loving, what if you find it in a man that is short, ugly, but he has all those good qualities? Are you going to say that you will not settle? Remember what I picked today. When you get what you want in another body, so many of so, so, so many times we make a lot of mistakes. You will see this person, and this person is so caring, he understands me and all that. But the only issue now is that he's not tall. And you will make mistakes looking for someone that is tall, that has all those qualities. And you end up wasting your time. You might not even see the person. So, so many things that are making people to remain where they are today is because they want more, more than what I don't even know. They, they don't they don't know what they want. Let me just put it that way. It's not as if they want more. They don't know what they want. You are looking for a man that is tall, dark, handsome, rich, and all that. And you meet another guy that is not tall, that is not all that handsome, but he's caring, he's God-fearing, he's understanding. Why not stick to him and you keep wasting your time waiting for the tall guy? What if you meet that guy and that guy doesn't love you? Maybe he loves someone else and you are still looking, you will be, you will you will be there waiting. You meet this guy, he's tall, dark, handsome, everything you want, but he wants a short lady. See, here, my brothers and sisters, this topic is for both male and female. It is not only for, for female. Sometimes a, a man will come out and tell you, I want a lady that is plumb, that is fair, that is hardworking, that is this, but she must be tall. Or she must be taller than me, or we might be at the same height. I've heard guys say that. And tomorrow you meet a girl that is not tall, maybe average height, but she's caring, she's understandable, she, she's loving. Why not stick to the person? See, you cannot get a full package because you that is looking for a full package, you don't have it. You don't have it. You can't get it like that, okay? You might see this person, he might not be as tall as you want, but he's caring, he's understanding, he's loving. He has all those good qualities inside him. Why not settle? Some of us has keep looking for outward appearance and a lot of mistakes has been going on in relationship. No, but I'm not saying that you shouldn't look for outward appearance. No, outward appearance is important. At least you should meet someone that looks good. Like me, if somebody is talking to me, I look at you first. You know, in my place, from the part of Nigeria that I came from, the eastern part you know there's this adage that says the, the, your eyes your eyes will first of all eat before your mouth will accept okay so when you see something your eyes will first of all see to get attracted to that person before you start knowing the content that is inside that person so i'm not saying that you shouldn't uh, 
I'm not saying that you shouldn't uh, look good or whatever. No, you should look good. But when you come close to the person and you notice that maybe this person is not tall as you want him or her, but the package that you're looking for is inside this person, why not just stick to this person? Why not just stick to the person? You say, no, she's caring, she's understanding, she has everything, but she's not tall. This is how you keep making mistakes, uncle. <laughs> this is how you keep making mistakes. So you, you better stick to the nice person that you see because there are not many. Even if they are, even if you say, yes, there are many, there's so many fishes in the ocean. You keep going to the ocean and you keep wasting your time. When opportunity fall at your lap, it is important that you grab it and make use of it. Don't allow it to fall. When it falls, it will be difficult for you to pick. So many people have keep you looking for tall, handsome guy that is caring, that is understandable, that has money. You that is looking for it. Are, is the, do you have all those things? Remember, you cannot get what you don't have. Or you a guy, you say, I want a lady that is hardworking, that is industrious, that is intelligent, that is uh, that will give me peace, that knows how to talk, that knows how to relate to people. You can you give her peace? What you do not have, what you do not have in you, you you might not get it. And if you're lucky enough to get what you are looking for, maybe in a lady that is, you know, like that is plump or that is not too tall, average. Or whatever and you know this is what you are looking for why not just stick to that why not just stick to that person then you're wasting time looking for what you do not have and you keep searching for every, all these things you might not get it or even if you get it I've seen some people some ladies that say oh this guy is handsome he's tall he's rich but he does not respect he doesn't respect them and you say yes, that you are just staying with him because he's handsome. Are you gonna eat handsome? Are you gonna eat that face? Sister, you're going to eat the content, not the not the not what is in the body, not what is in the face. It is the content that you are going to eat. So don't keep looking for things that you know. That you do not have even in you or you are looking for someone that is tall that is this that is that and you the full package you're looking for is just beside you and you're finding it difficult to grab that this great opportunity that is close to you because the package did not because the package comes small you keep complaining remember when you get what you want in another body it is important that you accept it and move on because that person you're looking for, that you're looking for, they say it must be this, it must be that, might not have a good character. I might not even love you or want, want you or even want, want to stay with you. And you keep wasting your time. And the funniest is that when you see another lady come and pick what that, that, that body that you, you, you don't want because it's not what the, the physical um, stuff that you are looking for and you see that lady progressing you start getting jealous as if someone as if someone you know cost you your anger sometimes we put ourselves in a situation that we, we purposely put ourselves in a situation that, that that will not suit us because of unnecessary wants I am not saying that you should stick to someone that does not, you know, befit you or whatever. But if you want somebody that is tall, handsome, caring, understandable, God-fearing and all that, and all those things that you are looking for, you see those things in a man that is not tall as you want it, it's not better you go to what you want. For example, you want all these good qualities in a tall guy. And you let us see these qualities in a short guy. What will you do? It is you see because you know this person has those qualities that you're looking for. The only difference is the body. If, if I were you, I would go for the other one that has the qualities that I'm looking for. See, in a relationship, a eh, peace of heart is very important. 
peace of mind is very very important if you cannot have peace in your relationship how are you going to uh, how are you going to be happy you are not going to be happy you might even shrink you see yourself shrink like this Happiness is important. So what will make you happy? I believe that is what you, you should go for or stick in. Sometimes you see some ladies, I'm just staying with him because he's so handsome. You're staying with him because he's so handsome and, you're, and you don't have peace. Why? You don't have peace. Peace is important. Peace of mind is important. So what am I saying today? When you get what you want in another body, go for it. Stop wasting your time. I'm going to repeat this thing I said again. If you get what you want in another body, stick to it. Stop wasting your time. So if you have not subscribed, please subscribe, like, and share. And don't forget to share this beautiful video to, with your family, friends, and those around you. I will be stopping here today. You always stay true to yourself. And have a beautiful and a lovely day. Bye-bye.